Hi, this is Ron Shira, and I just want to give a quick shot of appreciation to the many people who have helped me out during a time of a uh, severe need. I had um, in December, in, uh, during three weeks in December for 22 days, I was um, stranded in the Reading Hospital uh, with viral pneumonia in both of my lungs. I was admitted with respiratory failure, had 5% lung capacity in, uh, in, in both of my lungs, and um, was treated um, for uh, 13 days in the intensive care unit and the rest of the time in the recovery ward. And that was, uh, was a difficult time for me. Uh, they put me through a lot of tests, a lot of um, procedures. Uh, the um, medications were enormous. I had uh, uh, two CAT scans, an MRI, uh, and a lot of medication. Um, a lot of shots. I was black and blue all over from all the shots. And uh, generally I was in pretty bad shape. And when they uh, released me from the hospital two days before Christmas, I was housebound for about five weeks. Now, uh, during that time, I did not have any uh, disability because I had not signed up for it. I was, uh, when I had first gotten hired by uh, the Home Depot when I was working there, um, and still am working there, um, along with the Reading Eagle, Reading Eagle Times as, as an art critic, you could say that one's my career and the other's my job. Um, however, I can't get by without either of them. The um, whole situation with it is, is that I was given a lot of money by a lot of friends, a lot of people who have helped me out uh, throughout this time. Um, people gave me, you know, they ran me around, they bought me food, uh, they, uh, they, they took me places. Uh, I couldn't um, couldn't drive for about three weeks after I got out because I had no strength in my legs uh, to um, press on the brake to stop the car, so I was not allowed to drive. And um, the um, a bunch of my friends just had donated a lot of stuff, uh, like um, Jane, uh, Carolyn, Harold Halloran had. Uh, Giving me a very generous donation, you know, along with um, you know, Mary Stout and, um, and numerous others, actually, like a lot of people. I mean, you know, a lot of help from a lot of friends, too. Uh, Nancy Sarangoulis and Danny Looker uh, for um, doing a lot of work, a lot of collecting for me, and setting a fund for people to donate to. Uh, the uh, Reading Eagle for um, uh, George Hatza and uh, the friends over there uh, taking up a fine for me. Also at the Home Depot uh, with uh, Tom Dillon and uh, Charles Birch for all of the, um, the work that they did for me and all of the people that, you know, came over and visited me, visited me with, um, with really good food, too. Um, and, uh, that, uh, and, and the people that, that helped me out uh, later in the, in the game, like, um, like uh, Marilyn Fox and Robbie Pepper, uh, and Jane Runyon, uh, James Carroll, um, everybody doing a lot of things for me and really helping me out. They had a benefit for me over at uh, at uh, Robbie Pepper's um, studio gallery and um, helped me out a lot with that too. And I'm still I'm still benefiting from that, and that's greatly appreciated. But it's uh, it's it's hard to say how. How stunned I am, and how how not how bowled over to realize that I'm so you know appreciated uh, and, and cared for in this art community, and that uh, you know artists are. I've just always known this that 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 artists to me are like family. They're they're uh, you know, they're the closest people to me in the whole world. I mean, you know, next to my daughter, of course. And I just, um, 
you know, I love all of you, and I appreciate everything that you've done for me, and I want to um, intensify my involvement with it. You know, I just feel like I, uh, I should do more now. I just feel inspired and imbued to to uh, to more. And uh, it's hard to say because I don't really um, know how to say it. I'm not used to doing things like this. I've always considered myself somewhat of a of a lone wolf, uh, you know, of a, kind of like this rogue uh, pirate sort of guy, you know, that just does everything on his own and never never had to um, depend on anybody for anything, you know. But uh, I needed your help and you gave it to me and I appreciate that. So thank you, thank you, all of you. Thank you very much for for everything, you know. And this is also my first attempt at vlogging, um, so I'm not too used to uh, speaking into a camera and trying to come up with this stuff you know, like some of these others on YouTube are always so proficient at it and so easy at it. Maybe I can try to be like they are and be real nonchalant and just speak off the cuff. But anyway, thank you, and um, we'll talk more.